I wonder if you will share with us just a couple of nuggets of what people can do to raise private money. We all know that there's, you know, hard money out there. And although we'd love for them to use hard money at every given opportunity, <laughs> we know that private money is a great way to not only get into this business, but to stay in this business, whether you want to lend money or whether you want to be a borrower. So yep. can you share with us a couple of tips? Sure. Uh, or golden nuggets? Sure. Absolutely. So one popular question I get all the time is, well, Jay, how do you raise all that money? Well, one thing, so one nugget is mindset. So I don't ask for money. I don't beg. I don't sell. I don't chase. I educate people that I have some kind of relationship with, or I'm being introduced to. I'm educating people all the time what private money is and what self-directed IRAs are. Um, I've, Carol, Joe and I've got right now about 46 individuals, private lenders, individuals, human beings that are investing in our deals, loaning us money uh, that we move from house to house to house. And so none of those 46 people, zero had ever even heard of private money. They didn't know what private money was. So we put on our, teacher hat and our servant hat. We teach these people what private money is and how it works. Um, we also teach them about how they can use retirement funds to invest with us. So how do you prepare to do that? Well, I can't teach them about retirement funds unless I have got a relationship with a self-directed IRA company. So that when I meet someone that's got investment, I mean, that's got retirement funds and would like to get a higher rate of return safely and securely, I can introduce them to my connection at the self-directed IRA company. Over half of mine and Carol Joy's private lenders are investing with us by using their retirement funds. So where do you find these private lenders? Well, there's three, Four, three, three primary categories. <laughs> this is a short show, so I'll go from three. <laughs> there's, there's three primary. See, my brain looks like works like yours, Wendy. I'm talking, and my brain is thinking of more stuff to say. But anyway, <laughs> I got I got three categories of private lenders. Where do you find them? Number one is what I call your warm market. I'll define each one of these quickly. Your warm market. The second place you find them is what I call your expanded warm market. And the third place you find them uh, are, is the category called existing private lenders, individuals that are already loaning money out to real estate investors. Let me start with pile of money. Number one, um, warm market. Who's your warm market? Well, your warm market are people that you got some kind of association with. They're in your cell phone. They're on your email list. They're on your Facebook friend list. And I don't mean your fake Facebook friends. <laughs> I mean, people you actually love. I mean, I know y'all look, who in the world is that? Anyway, <laughs> your real Facebook friends, your LinkedIn connections. And so those people, I've got five steps in my uh, recent book that I just released that your Sunrisers learned about. In my recent book, Where to Get the Money Now, I teach in the book, the five steps how to attract money without asking for it uh, in your warm market. All right. That's one category. Second category are expanded warm market. You know, a lot of times my students will say, well, Jay, my warm market is broke. My people ain't got no money. <laughs> Number one, I don't believe them. Right. I believe they are intimidated to approach people because they still got that hat on of chasing and begging and they got a fear somebody's going to say no. So anyway, expanded warm market. So I teach people in the book as well, in the book. <laughs> I teach people in the book uh, how to grow your warm market very fast. I say the more money you waller in, the more money sticks to you. So go to where the money is and where is it? It's in your backyard. 
Mm-hmm. It's your community. It's your Rotary Club. It's your church. It's your Chamber of Commerce. It's your Business Networking International. It's your BizConnect. It's your RIA. It's all your social connections. So what do you do with those people? You educate them on what private money is. How do you do that? The book explains all that. Category number three are existing private lenders. Where in the world do you find existing private lenders that are already loaning money out? I'm not talking about institutional money such as Carolina Capital. I'm talking about individuals that are already loaning uh, loaning money out, right? So where do you find them? A couple of different places. First of all, I hired my real estate attorney's paralegal years ago to search local public records for individuals that had deeds of trust, mortgages, loaning money out on single family houses. Here in my little teeny tiny area, we found one (laughs) in nine (laughs) days. One. I said, hmm, got to be a better, quicker way. So we paid a lot of money, got some sophisticated software, and we created the private lender data feed that gets every individual closing of an individual that's loaned money on real estate in the nation every month. We update it every month. Um, You can search by zip code in the data feed. Again, the book will give you access to it. But the other existing private lenders are back to the self-directed IRAs. My land, Mm -hmm. those self-direct and COVID has opened up. Thank the Lord. The, the self-directed IRA companies are now having in person, and Zoom still networking events. Well, 70% of those people that's got a self-directed IRA account, their clients that they're loaning money to are real estate investors. That's right. right. So there's back to your expanding your warm market. Go to the self-directed IRA networking events and network. And uh, we don't have time to talk about it in your show right now, but always lead with a give lead with a give when you're talking to people, how can you serve them? Don't go to these networking events with gimme, 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 gimme. What value can you bring to people as you go to the networking event? Jay. Jay, that's incredible information. 